Well, Fox 51 News is your local election headquarters. After President Joe Biden announced on Sunday he will not be seeking re-election, many were reacting to the stunning turn of events, including political party leaders right here in East Texas. Well, Fox 51's Zoe Hoffman has reaction as well as what people think as we inch closer to November. It certainly is a very unusual race for what what we've seen over the last 50 years or so. After President Joe Biden announced on Sunday he's not seeking re-election in November, the reactions are pouring in. It was expected. You could see the way that the, the winds were shifting. I believe that President Biden has done more for our country internationally as well as nationally. Dr. Kenneth Wink, a professor of public administration at UT Tyler, says there could be several reasons as to why he made the decision, especially with his health in question. Maybe there are some health, legitimate health things that are going on and he just felt like he could not compete uh, very strongly. Smith County Republican Chair David Stein feels some Democrats should be disappointed over the decision. 14 million of them voted for a candidate and, and now through the primary process, it appears that that's not going to be how they are selecting their candidate. East Texas Democratic Delegate Dr. Nancy Nichols, who plans to be at the Democratic National Convention in August, said with Biden endorsing Kamala Harris, it's a no-brainer to support her. She is a very, very strong leader in and of her own right. Adding she could have success on the campaign trail. She's going to bring the women to the polls and we have seen how powerful that is. Stein feels she has an unreliable track record and isn't qualified to be president. She was going to single-handedly take on the border. Well, what has she done? She hasn't done anything. Wink adding at this point, Democrats feel she is in the best position to beat Donald Trump. I think she does have more upside. I think we sort of knew what was gonna happen with, with Biden. For Fox 51 News, I'm Nolan Huffman.